Welcome back. Well, over 100 students from the South Andrews High School being exposed to multiple careers in the Bahamas. The initiative is part of the school's annual careers fair, which attracted top professionals from various industries in the capital. Ethan Gibson and Ashanti Andrews are top performing students at the South Andrews High School. They both share a drive for success. Ethan is a grade 11 student who wants to pursue medicine in Canada, and Ashanti has high hopes of becoming a top engineer. Both view the careers fair as a vital springboard to achieve their dream. So far, it is um, been great, and it has like opened my mind to make many difference of career where I didn't even talk. What was like happening? Career fair was great. Uh, it was really good to see all graduates. They came back, and how successful they were. It was. It made me. It inspired me to choose new careers. Uh, the diversity of all the careers is nice to see. 130 students attend the South Andrews High School in Congo Town. The event attracted 30 professionals from 18 industries. School principal Sheena Duncombe says the annual fair is already reaping positive dividends. I have one student who came in this morning who was just a graduate of the class of 2016. So they know now that, you know, it doesn't take forever to achieve a substantial career and that if they put their minds to it, they can do whatever they want. Event coordinator Zendel Forbes is a native of South Andros who feels the program's value has far-reaching implications. Andros is the largest island in the Bahamas with the fifth largest landmass in the Caribbean. It is a vibrant economy with rich natural resources and untapped potential. We thought it's important to expose the students here to various different opportunities that they could go that they could go into and leave in school because I, I, I find a lot of persons just don't know. Representatives from the Bahamas Marine Science Institute and the Royal Bahamas Police Force were also on hand to discuss the vast opportunities within their fields. From what we've seen, they're responding very well. They're enthusiastic about it. And I believe by the time we leave, we're going to have many more officers from this school in the Royal Bahamas Police Force. The students today in this session seem very interested in what we're offering at BOMC. Um, they're surprised by the amount of programs that we offer. Like I said earlier, most people think associate BOMC with just agriculture. But they were very much interested in the marine science program, the environmental science program. This event began in 2009. Organizers believe this initiative could be the impetus in putting a dent in the high unemployment numbers while reviving the economic lifeblood of South Andros.